Sim, isso me olha to boy, que é something. Good morning to all, my amazing chosen one out there. So, I have something special for us today. They play a good, a drum of what of shame. And they are wondering why you are not dancing. They are wondering why you are not dancing after everything that they have done. You know, the truth is this. You know, when people are talking bad of you, they are really talking bad of you in order for you to respond. When people are talking bad of you, they are talking bad of you in order for you to do what to bother, to be unhappy, to be sad. Because they want to let you know that they truly hate you. They want to let you know that they will hurt you. They will make you become sad. They can create unha unhappiness within you. They can make you feel unhappy. But many of them are shocked why you are not bothered despite of everything that they have been seeing behind you. Despite of every, everything they have been doing to frustrate you. Everything that they have been doing to, you know, to make you feel what bothered. Everything that they have been doing behind your back. So many people are wondering, why is it that all these things that they have been doing to stop you, and yet you don't feel bothered, you don't feel like something is happening within you, you don't feel like you are in trouble, you don't feel like there is something going on. So this really hurt a lot of people. Many people are devastated because after everything that they have done to you, talk shit on your name, say all manners of words, you know, try to bring you down, try to frustrate you, yet you feed on board that. It really frustrates a lot of people. Believe me, it really frustrates a lot of people. Because after everything that you have gone through, because of what they did to you, yet you are still what happy. <laughs> that is why I always tell us, you know, when they try to make you feel unhappy, surprise them by what by smiling even if even if what they did to you hurt you but surprise them by smiling you got to understand that someone will just be suffering because of you <laughs> because when they are talking bad of you when they are talking shit you know trying to betray you say also the reason why they are doing all those things is because they want to make you feel bothered they want to make you feel unhappy they want to make you feel restless that is why they keep talking shit on your name telling people what is not real telling people you are a bad person telling people you are bad you are this you are that they will never open up to them or whom you really are they will never open up to them your real you why because they are angry they are angry they are frustrated because they don't know how and what else to do to stop you from progressing that is why they start to create all these manners you know there was i was discussing with one of my friends he said do you know that when people have done everything they have did everything to make sure they stop you you know from progressing from succeeding that sometimes many of them will start we just start to do what create problem when they can't you know when after everything that they have done to you did not work, the next thing that they will do, they will start to create mist in which they will create some some little, little problem to spoil your name, to tell people bad about you, to tell people you are this, you are that, which in reality they know that you are not. But they are doing all these things in order for them to make people believe that you are a bad person indeed. But within them, they know that you are truly a good person. You are a nice person. You are special. But they will never compliment that. They will never tell people whom you really are. You know what I'm saying? So a lot of people are frustrated. Hot. Why? Because everything that they have done to make you unhappy, all the whole drama, all the whole drama they have played to make you feel sad, Yet you are still happy. You know, that is what I learned particularly from my dad. Yes, believe me. Everything. That is the greatest thing. 
Yes, I have learned a lot from my dad, a lot, because he himself learned a lot from his his own parents. Believe me, when he start to narrate to me that I am not intelligent, I'm not this. I don't feel bad because indeed I'm not intelligent. Believe me, because if eventually I learn everything that my dad teach me, then because I play rough, if not because of all of them, I know that I, <laughs> I will have been like a super a super ego according to Nigeria, because my head it used to tell me your head is a coconut head. They will talk here, you will fly from here. <laughs> so what am I trying to say is this. You need to understand the fact that some people are what are suffering. Because after all the whole drama they have played, they have done this, they have done that, yet you are no you are not feeling bothered. You know, they trouble my parents too much, believe me. They trouble them in all angles trouble everywhere but yet despite of all this trouble one point to another you will never see my father or my mother be like this mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. yes my mom as a woman she can feed she can sometimes she can be like lonely feel bad uh feel feel little depressed because she is a woman but you can never see my dad a day or an hour without smiling. That is why they changed his own name to Joy Joy. Joy. The, our community, they start to call him Joy Joy. Eating Joy, laughing Joy, eat, drinking. Because you can never see my dad it's sad. And that is what I learned. Anytime, maybe I'm at work or I'm passing by or I meet someone, people will be, just be surprised. So I said, what is that thing that really make you smile always? Because that is what I have learned from my parents. So many people are frustrated because after all the drama they make, after all the effort that they have made to make you sad, yet you are still what? You are still happy. After everything that they have done to make you unhappy, yet you are still smiling, you are still rejoicing, you are still celebrating life. It really bothered them and it really would frustrate them. You know what I'm saying? So remain place me go be still. <laughs> this is just the far truth. Many people are suffering because they are not seeing you what bothered. They are not seeing the sign that you are bothered after all the drama, the betrayed, the frustration, the bad bite, the gossip, the gossip with your name, and yet you are not bothered at all. That really frustrates them. Because think about it. When people are talking bad of you, you in London. They feel pain. <laughs> they feel the pain of you not responding to their to their word, to their expectation. Because the expectation is that the reason why they are playing that drum is because they want to hear your word, your response. But yet you you zip your mouth and it do what it kill them. You know what I'm saying? So remember blessed, may God bless you.